There are a total of 27 military attack helicopters in the world, from the origin to present day. With the Sikorsky YR-4B is generally recognized as the first combat helicopter and was used in the Second World War. Attack helicopters are purpose-built military aircraft that have the ability to decimate the enemy's fighting capabilities by going after troop concentrations, armored vehicles, and even marine vessels. Most of them also carry air-to-air -air weapons that can be fired at airborne threats. If deployed effectively, attack helicopters can turn the tide of war and help secure victory on the battlefield. But, which one is the best attack helicopter in the world right now? Which is the greatest and most advanced amongst these and why? Here is a list of the top 10 most advanced attack helicopters in the world. But before we jump into number 1, be sure that you have subscribed and hit the bell icon to keep yourself informed with amazing videos. With that said let's jump into our incredible list. 10. OH-58 Kiowa. This aircraft served the United States Army for nearly half a century as a light attack and reconnaissance helicopter. The Kiowa accounted for almost 50% of all Army reconnaissance and attack missions flown in Iraq and Afghanistan within a nine-year period, from 2001 to 2010. The helicopter can be equipped with machine guns and rockets, but its main fear factor came from its ability to call in the heavy guns like the fearsome Apache helicopters, A-10 Thunderbolt aircraft, or heavy artillery. Sighting one on the battlefield was an ominous sign of something far deadlier on the horizon. Nine, mil Mi-24 Hein, Russia. The Mi-24 is a massive attack helicopter that is designed for close air support of ground troops. The helicopter is powered by over 2,000 horsepower engines that can propel the aircraft at speeds of up to 205 miles per hour. The Mi-24 can be rapidly deployed to the front lines where it can unleash its load of bombs, 122 mm ground rockets, or a hellish rain of 12.7 mm bullets from its four-barreled machine gun. The helicopter is also big enough to carry eight fully loaded infantrymen and has side windows that can serve as firing ports if needed. Eight, Augusta A-129 Mangusta, Italy. The AW-129 is Italy's primary multi-role helicopter and can be equipped for a wide variety of combat missions, ranging from armed reconnaissance to fire support and threat suppression. The helicopter can carry both air-to-ground and air-to-air -air weaponry, depending on the mission. It can also be fitted with external fuel tanks, greatly extending its operational range and giving it an edge over the opposition. The AW-129 Mangusta has been successfully deployed in combat with the United Nations in countries like Somalia, Angola, and Kosovo. 7. Danila II Ruovic. South Africa. Despite its new appearance, the Ruovic was based on reverse-engineered Averospediale Puma and uses the same engines and rotor. This helicopter has been designed to operate without sophisticated support. A nose turret of the Ruovic is fitted with a 20mm cannon. It contains an automatic target detection and tracking system. This attack helicopter can carry indigenous ZT-6 Makopa anti-tank missiles, similar to US Hellfire. Surprisingly these are one of the most powerful anti-tank guided missiles in the world. Alternatively this South African gunship helicopter can carry up to 16 smaller tow anti-tank guided missiles. Also it has provision for air-to-air -air missiles and pods with 70mm unguided rockets. This gunship can be used in anti-armor, ground attack, armed reconnaissance, fire support, escort and deep penetration roles. A pair of external seats can be fitted to the Ruovic, allowing it to pick up the crew of a downed helicopter. Currently only 11 of these helicopters are operational due to funding problems. 6. Z-10. China. The Z-10 is the first Chinese dedicated attack helicopter. It has been designed with extensive technical assistance from Eurocopter and Augusta. Other sources claim that development of this attack helicopter has been assisted by the Russian Kamov Helicopter Design Bureau. 
It seems that first production gunships were delivered to the Chinese Army in 2009 to 2010. Primary mission of the Z-10 is anti-armor and battlefield interdiction. It also has some limited air-to-air -air combat capabilities. The fuselage has sloped sides to reduce radar cross-section. All vital areas are believed to be protected by armor plates. Weapons of the Z-10 are 30mm cannon, HJ-9 anti-tank guided missiles, newly developed HJ-10 anti-tank missiles and Ti-90 air-to-air missiles. It can also carry unguided rocket pods. Five, Eurocopter Tiger. The Eurocopter Tiger helicopter had its first flight in 1991, but it was not until 2002 that serial production began. It is currently being built by Airbus helicopters and was initially meant for France and Germany, though it is now being used by other European countries and Australia as well. The helicopter is available in a variety of configurations, but the primary aim is to provide support for troops on the field, and it is very well equipped for that. Its armament includes 70mm Hydra rockets, Stinger missiles, and different types of machine guns. The Eurocopter Tiger also has an advanced electronic countermeasure suite to protect itself, just in case the enemy chooses to stand and fight. 4. Mil, Mi-28 Havoc, Russia. The Mi-28 has been in development since the late 1970s. This helicopter was finally accepted to service with the Russian Army in 2006. Currently Russian Army operates only a relatively small number of these helicopters. Some sources report that it is also in service with Kenya. This attack helicopter is fitted with two heavily armored cockpits. Probably it is one of the most armored attack helicopters to date. The Mi-28 is also fitted with emergency escape system for the crew. The Mi-28 is typically fitted with eight Ataka anti-armor missiles, along with unguided rocket pods. This gunship is also fitted with a 30mm cannon. Comparing with the previous Mi-24 Hind it is better optimized for anti-armor role. It lacks secondary troop transport capability. However the Mi-28 has a small passenger compartment, and in case of emergency, it can carry three passengers. This feature allows to rescue crashed helicopter crew members. 3. Bell A1Z Viper. USA. The world's most advanced attack helicopter, Bell A1Z, is a modern version of the A1 Cobra. Bell A1Z flies with the most advanced aircraft weapons and survivability equipment in the world. It is the only attack helicopter with a fully integrated air-to-air -air missile capability. The Bell A1Z Viper has a 20mm, with 750 rounds, 3-barrel cannon and carries M114 ABC anti-tank missiles, M114F anti-ship missiles, AIM-9 air-to-air missiles, pods with 70mm unoperated rockets and free-fall bombs. 2. Boeing A64 e Apache Guardian. USA. As far as best attack helicopters go, the American four-blade, twin turboshaft with a tailwheel-type landing gear arrangement and a tandem cockpit for a two-man crew. Makes Boeing A64 e Apache Guardian the most advanced ever built. With a maximum speed of 300 km per hour the Apache Guardian has a 30mm cannon and carries 16 M114L Hellfire. Two anti-tank missiles. 4 AIM-92 Stinger or 2 AIM-9 Sidewinder air-to-air -air missiles. 2 AIM-122 Sidearm anti-radiation missiles and 19-shot Hydra-70 rocket pod. One, Kamov Ka-52 Hakam B, Russia. The Ka-52 is a further development and a two-seat version of the famous Ka-50 Hakam. This attack helicopter entered service with the Russian army, and its small-scale production commenced in 2008. The Ka-52 is one of the fastest and most maneuverable attack helicopters due to its two coaxial contra-rotating main rotors. 
Armor of this gunship withstands hits from 23mm projectiles. Pilots are seated in ejection seats. This gunship is armed with a 30mm cannon and up to 12 Vic Ranti tank missiles. It can also carry unguided rockets and IGLA V air to air missiles. The Ka 52 is fitted with a battlefield management system and can exchange data with other helicopters, as well as third party sources. This helicopter is also intended as an aerial command post for a group of helicopters. It provides target detection and coordinates the attacks.